Good day to everyone. Today I would like to share how to schedule live on Facebook and share advance link to your participant or students. Yes, we can schedule Google Meet event and send the live stream link in advance to your students and participant so that they can aware this time your program will be start. Let's see how to do that. Before that, kindly subscribe Howex channel and click the bell icon so that you can get the useful videos and the notification. Just log in your Facebook account, you will find three dots on the top. So create room, photo, video, tag friends and three dots is here. Just hit the button, you will find a different kind of menus. In here, you will find live video. You can choose this one. This is a one of the step. Otherwise, just hit the button on your profile. So automatically your profile picture and the screen will be open here. In the top, create post, photos and video and live video. Just hit the button live video. So there are two options is available. You can hit the button. It will direct you to the live stream option. So once you click the live stream option your camera will be activated I am using laptop if you are using mobile phone your camera will be activated in your live stream Facebook page yeah so this is the basic steps you need to follow just to scroll down you will find the stream option so end live stream if stream stop so we need to end the live stream if the stream is stop an embedded video if you want to share with website or anything else you can embed the video and unpublish after live video ends so if you want to publish in your facebook page you can have the access on this otherwise you if you give the tick means after the stream will get ends means your video will be hide from the public so the admin can view the video once you remove the tick means automatically your video will be published so your event all event live events will be published so here the viewing, viewing option allow viewers to rewind so the your viewers can rewind your program and if you want they want to see means you can give enable the tick and this is a ma major important step you need to set up your camera for example if you are going to be a live means you need to set up your camera so your camera will be activated here and here your mic for example if you have your google meet you need to check your microphone as well as your speaker is working properly yes and the third step start screen sharing here the mic is working means here the waves will come here the blue screen as you see the waves in the thumb means your microphone will be work here so choose according to your microphone whatever microphone you have you can choose according to your needs and start screen share so my tab i'm going to create google meet yeah so i just hit the button google meet and i just start instant event so this is an event I have. So Google Meet event. I want to share. I want to share my screen. I just hit start screen share here, and it will ask you your entire screen or application window. For example, if you are showing some other application, Photoshop or Illustrator, any any other tutorial you are making, means you can choose application window or Chrome tab because I'm using Google Chrome. So just hit the button Chrome tab. Chrome tab has live stream, Facebook as well as the Google Meet. I just select Google Meet and click share means only the Google Meet screen will be shared to your audience. I just remove the mic. Your microphone will be work means the waves will come. So the audience can able to hear your voice. Once the audience is entered into your uh, Google Meet, they can also able to talk. So everything will be live stream with the audio with video so as you see here you can click stop sharing option so automatically your live stream will be, uh, come back to the facebook yeah so now the most important point schedule a live video so we need to schedule the live video uh, because my event is tomorrow 
morning till o'clock. So I need to schedule the event. Just click schedule live video, and it will direct you to the date and time option. Just select date. So today is fourth. I just select fifth September. I have uh, a event. I just select the time. So just I select ten o'clock. So ten a.m. I selected and shared your timeline. For example, your schedule event will be shared your timeline or shared to your page you manage. If you're managing your page, Facebook page means you can share with your page and share the group. So you can choose according to your needs. I have selected shared to your timeline, and this is a public or friends view or uh, a specific friends and only me. You can choose according to your needs. I selected public view and live video. Title. You need to give your live video title and just to give how XT live. So I just give the description. Stay tuned. At 10 a.m. I just give some description about my uh, live stream and just to scroll down, you will find the select image, the thumbnail image. You need to paste so that your audience or your friends can see the uh, thumbnails means they may able to understand i just click select image if you have a uh, image if you have any other image for the thumbnail you just choose so i just selected uh, how to share the powerpoint uh, i just select the thumbnail so your thumbnail also will be added here yeah so once you complete all this uh, procedure once uh, you select the date and time and uh, your timeline and your uh, title and your image just hit the button schedule live video so it will take few minutes after that yes it will take few minutes after that schedule live the live has been successfully scheduled at tomorrow at 10 a.m because today is for to tomorrow or day after tomorrow or uh, anytime you can schedule the event so just to close this tool so automatically it will direct you to the live stream option so live streaming is there so you can waiting for the live stream video so this is a general live stream key option so we already set the key and if you want to end the live stream i already explained about this kind of things if you want to get the url link so server url and stream key also will be available for the live stream so you can access here yeah so now I'm going to show you about stream health. So stream health in the sense, if your internet connection will be level, what is the level of your internet connection, everything video, bit rate and frame rate, everything will be added here. You can give the graphical treatment and you can start pooling options. So you can ask the question to the audience. So you can start your pool options and you can ask the question make your uh, uh, live video will be more vibrant you can ask the questions as well as you can start polling and you can make your uh, video will be very uh, interactive session so that you can create a polling option for example uh, what what is your lunch i just given lunch i just uh, give the option which non which and add an option of called or preferred so you can give according to your uh, thing and you can save so your question will be added here once you can start your streaming you can start polling option also it will be available major important thing once you schedule the event if you are going to start your event just hit the button schedule event we already scheduled and upcoming live video and events just hit the button automatically it will direct you to the video whatever we scheduled for example tomorrow 10 am will be the live stream option so if you want to edit post you can edit the post you can click and view the post for example this is your timeline so i have given stay tuned at 10 am tomorrow 10 am how it's live so get a reminder your friends and your 
participant will get the remainder also once they click means automatically they'll get the remainder you can share with your public place and you can share with the message and share with your group and share with your friends time that also will be available yes as well as here the three dots will be available you can copy your live url video link and you can share with your friends with the whatsapp or facebook or any other social media as well as mail you just copy the link and send to your friends friends and uh, uh, a participant yes once you schedule the time is 10 o'clock you are going to be alive means just hit the button go live now so automatically your event will be the live so you can schedule and you need to click go live now means automatically your video will be in the live stream and if you want to delete or cancel the event just select here and cancel broadcast so automatically to ask you cancel live video just hit the button cancel live video your video will be cancelled just hit the button so how it's home page so there is no schedule yeah. so there is no schedule thanks for watching have a good day